Hey from Cute's back. Tell a love friend. Guess who's back? 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 Da -da -da -da. Hey, did anybody know that song? You don't know that song? Eminem. Guess who's back? That was the jam back in the day. Anyways, it's your girl, K from Cute. If you're new, welcome. Don't forget to subscribe. And if you're returning, thank you, thank you, thank you for coming again. So, today we're going to talk about pricing. A very, very, very important part of your business. Because it's all about making a profit, right? So, I'm going to go over a pricing strategy that I use to help you make a profit because I get a lot of customers saying am I charging too much no girl you charging just enough if they don't want it keep it moving whoever wants it will buy it do not ever settle for a low price to please a customer never 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 because at the end of the day you're hurting yourself these materials are not cheap please remember that um I'm going to go over a basic pricing for jade gemstones. So to do a single bracelet, with a charm, we would need our stone. The two common stones are agate and jade, and most people pay $5 a strand for those. Then charms can go anywhere from $1.50 to $3. So we're gonna use our highest price point at $3. And then I calculate labor at $10. And things to consider is your time and other miscellaneous things like stretch cord and glue, okay? So the average size strand of beads can make you two bracelets using a standard size worth of seven to seven and a half inches. So $5 divided by two is 250. But we want to times that by two anyways to get our profit. So you still at $5. Charms usually go anywhere, like I said, between $150 and $3. We used our highest price point, And I always just like to do a standard charm addition fee of $5. And labor is $10. So if you add... 10 plus 5 plus 5, you get 20. And this is what I charge for a single charm bracelet. So yes, if Mother Mary wanted to buy this, it's $20 just for the one. So... When I do my stacks, I do a small discount because most of the time you're using the same colors, which means you don't have to open up a new strand, which would be covered under this $5. So this particular stack would cost one. So you have the fee for the first charm bracelet, which is 20. And then I just take all $5 and add 15. Also, when I priced this bracelet and I used my price points at $15 per bracelet, given that $5 discount, please always consider how much you're spending on your other pieces. So 
So I know for sure none of these pieces were over $5, which is why I was able to use the price point that I did. But if you are buying focal pieces and larger charms that are costing way more than $5, please charge accordingly. The object is to make your money back plus some. You're wasting your time if you don't. You are wasting your time if you don't. If someone tries to bargain you down on your price, it's a no. It's a double no. Because they cannot go to Foot Locker and want a pair of shoes and say, but I don't like your price. Foot Locker is going to laugh at them. You do the same. And make sure when you tell Mother Mary when she's ready to order her bracelet, you need all your coins up front. All of them. Not half, not a quarter, all of them. Because you got those people who won't put in a custom charm bracelet request. Don't pay you your money. You buy the materials. You make the bracelet. And you never hear from them again. No, sis. Don't do it. Not for your mother. Not for your sister. I'm just keeping it real with you because I had this problem happen to me personally. And I had to learn. And it was family. Not for your mother. Not for your sister. Not for your daughter. I don't care. She got paid too. And not for your grandmother. I love her daily. You love her daily, but not for your grandmother either. You need all your coins up front, sis. When they go to Walmart and they place their orders online, they got to pay before they ship their products. Correct? Correct. Get all your coins, sis. All things considered, it took us $20 to make this bracelet so we used a total of two strands because remember one strand will get us two bracelets and one strand is five dollars so that's ten dollars just for the beads and a charm is about two dollars so now we're at 12 focal bead is about three dollars now we're at 15 i sell these in my shop for a dollar a piece so that's two dollars right there so 17 and this will run you about two dollars 19 and then don't forget your stretch cord and your glue now you're at twenty dollars so, with you spending $20 on materials to make those four bracelets and you're charging $65, that's a markup of $45. Please do put some of that back into your business account, yes, for your next investment, and then put some in your personal pocket. Cha-ching, because you need some money too for the time you took to make your bracelet. Mm -hmm.